everyone! Today I wanted to show you how to play The Night We Met by Lord Huron. Uh, the song was uh, featured on the show 13 Reasons Why. I made a cover for this song. You can check out the link in the description box or at the end of this video. So alright, let's get in right into it. Um, I'll play the introduction for you, then I'll show you how to play the right hand and the left hand. Let's do it. Okay. So now let me teach you how to play the right hand for the introduction. It's actually really, really simple. You just have to play A, G sharp, E, then C sharp, E, F sharp, just like that. Then you repeat it again. And that's all for the right hand. Alright, so now I'm going to teach you how to play the left hand for the introduction. Uh, now, the left hand is actually the same for the entire song. So if you can learn the left hand right now, you'll basically be able to master uh, the entire left hand for the song. So um, it sounds like this. This is for the introduction part. And that's basically F sharp, A, A and C sharp. Then it's E, G sharp, and B. And then you play E, A, and C sharp. Okay, that's for the first chord. Now for the second chord, you go to the same thing, F sharp, A, and C sharp. And then you go to E, A, and C sharp. And then you go to D, F sharp, and A. So I repeat it one more time. F, A sharp, uh, sorry, F, A, and C sharp. Then E, A, and C sharp. And then D, F sharp, and A. So the whole thing for the introduction sounds like this. For the first part of the introduction, actually, it's F sharp, A, and C sharp. And after that, you transition to the next part, which you will play the entire song for the left hand, which is F sharp, F sharp, C, F sharp, A, F sharp, C. the first chord you play and then you go to E, G sharp and B so you play that E, G sharp, B and then you go to A chord you repeat that twice so A, E, A, C sharp, A Repeat it back again. F sharp, C sharp, F sharp. Then you go to A, F sharp, C. Then you go to E, G sharp, and B. Then you go to A, E, A, C sharp, A, E, A, E, A, C sharp, A, E. Then when you repeat it back again, to D now, D, A, D, F sharp, D, A, so you play that chord, D chord with F sharp, D, A, D, F sharp, D, A. Alright, so now 
now let me teach you how to play the left hand and the right hand for the introduction. Uh, so it basically sounds like this. So what I'm doing here is I'm pressing A on the right hand. When I press A on the right hand, I press F sharp, A, and C sharp on the left hand. So I play them together. And then when I press G sharp on the right hand, I press uh, E, G sharp, and B on the left hand. Then when I press E on the right hand, I press E, A, and C sharp on the left hand. So, then when I go to G, I press E, G sharp, and B on the left hand. And then when I go to E, I press uh, uh, E, A, and C sharp. And then after that, I continue with the next chord, which is C sharp. Then I press F. When I press C sharp on the right hand, I press F sharp, A, and C sharp on the left hand. And then when I press E on the right hand, I press E, A, and C sharp on the left hand. And then to end it, I press F sharp on the right hand while I press D, F sharp, and A on the left hand. So basically, I'm pressing a chord on the left hand every time I'm pressing anything on the right hand in the introduction. So it goes like this. One more time. Alright, so after you're done with the first part, you repeat the introduction again. So um, basically you go like that. On the right hand, I press F sharp, C sharp, F sharp. Then I go to A, F sharp, C sharp. So it's. Then when I go to G sharp, I press E, G sharp, and B on the left hand. Then I press continue playing E without anything on the left hand. So when I press E, alone, nothing on the left hand, I continue with A, 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 E, A, C sharp, A, E. So it sounds like this, when A is my cue to begin, then I go to G sharp, I press E, E, G sharp, B, then I press E without anything on the left hand, and I play the A chord on the left hand. So then I repeat back, I continue it, so it goes. So now when I press C sharp on the left hand, I press F sharp chord, so. And then I go to E. When I press E on the, uh, on the right hand, I press E. again I press F sharp on the left hand alone with no right hand and I continue instead of going to A I go to D so it sounds overall like this so repeat that twice the D chord D A D F sharp D A so the second time you play the introduction, it sounds like this. I'm going to play it slowly for you. So now let me 
me play the first verse for you, which sounds like this. to play the right hand for the first verse which sounds like this so basically what I'm doing here is I'm pressing A four times at the beginning I am not B then I go to B then I go to A again Traveler, I'm pressing A and C sharp twice. If you don't want to press A and C sharp twice, if, it, if you have that difficult, you can just press tra Traveler, C sharp twice. But I prefer pressing A and C sharp together. Then it, got, it goes to Who has not repaid his debt? And that will be A three times. Who has not? Then I go to C sharp. Then B. Then A. Then F sharp. And then it goes to I've been searching for trail to follow. And that's I've been searching. So that's B, C sharp. So I've been searching for this to A and C sharp twice. Then go to B, C sharp again. Then you continue to take me back to four times A. Then you go C sharp, B, A. And then you repeat that again with And that I can't tell myself And that's And that I can't So that's four times A And that I can't Then you go to B And then you go back to A Then A, C and sharp twice So then you go to A and C sharp You press it four times Then you go to B. Then you repeat that three times. Do, do. So, suppose. Do, do. And then I repeat A four times. And that I can tell B. A and C sharp. Twice. Then we go A and C sharp four times. to long three times so one 